Hi everybody, this is Kim Sashio Kent from Skyline College, and I'm going to show you how to use the immersive reader that's built into Canvas. All right, so we are looking at a page in a Canvas shell. Notice that there's this button here, immersive reader, right? Just click the button. So when the immersive reader opens, it lets us adjust the voice settings. Let's go ahead and click that just to start listening and see what we think about those settings. GPS info session kickoff. Welcome to the GPS online information session. Let's see if we have any other voices we can use. Frankly, I find that one a little annoying. So we click the speaker down here and we have a voice selection. Let's see about mail, right? And then we can just click anywhere. And when we're ready, we click the green button again. Starting fall 2020, the Disability Resource Center, DRC, will be renamed the Educational Access Center, EAC. So that voice actually is less annoying to me. I think I'll just keep it on that. You'll note that the text is large and there's space between all the letters. Let's see what other options we have here. We have text preferences. We can increase the text size and take away that extra spacing. We can change the font. And then they even have themes. So there's a dark theme. A lot of people would find that one useful. Grammar options. That could be useful if you want to to do a little grammar tutorial for yourself. Okay, reading preferences. Show one line of text while reading. Now this could be very useful if you've got focus challenges or just turn it off. So that's basically it. And when you're done, you just click the arrow to get back to the page. Very easy, but it only works on pages. It's not gonna work on quizzes or discussions or anything else. Other than that, it's a very useful tool. Thank you for joining me.